Hello and welcome to another episode of Mortgage Video Mastermind, where we bring you professionals who share insight into the latest trends, tips, industry, technology, and services to help you create more videos to use in your mortgage business. There we are. We are live. So happy Wednesday, everyone. Happy hump day. This is Ginger Bell, and today... I have with me uh, our Carl White. Um, thank you so much for joining us. Carl, we're always happy to have you. And we have a special guest today, David Wakefield. And so, Carl, I know you have worked with David um, for several years. And it's funny because, David, you don't even know this, but Carl had sent me a video that I don't know if you sent it to him or he got a hold of it and he sent it to me and he said we need to get David onto our show and I said he's lined up I agree 100% so uh <laughs> so you've got some some fandom going on with Carl so uh so Carl I'll, I'll you know let you kind of tee it up with David and then David I know you're in the middle of a big launch right now so I want to get into that as well sure sure yeah so Dave uh Dave how long have we known each other Dave it's been a while probably four years or something, I guess. Something yeah, like that. It, um, yeah. It seems like see, in a good way, it seems like a long time. And, <laughs> uh, no, in a good way, right? It does. It seems like we've known each other a long time. So the one thing, Ginger, I can say about Dave is Dave hears a good idea and he just runs with it. Right. And I think he's going to give us a good example of what, of what uh, of, of, even he heard something this morning and Boone, he jumped on it and uh, clicked the, uh, click the record button on his video. And, and he was off and running. So, Sweet. you know, if you ever hesitate about, gee, what do I look like? Or how does this sound? Or is this going to be okay? Uh, we're going to hear from Dave about, man, just click the record button and go with it. Because video is very, very impactful uh, to your group. So, uh, so uh, uh, Ginger, you want to ask him about like some of the different things that he's doing here? So, yeah, yeah so absolutely. He's just a take action kind of guy. And I just absolutely <laughs> love him for doing that. And, and instead of making it perfect, he makes it right now. Right. Well, and that's the key. So a couple of things I want to have you talk about, Dave. So first of all, I want to talk about the individual videos that you're sending to your real estate partners. Sure. And then the other thing I want you to talk about is just what you started. So uh, I, I think as part of the Breakfast Club, there was a challenge that was put down for $10,000. And you said, I'm in. So, which, by the way, which, by the way, I, I know I do the budgeting or let me write, let me rephrase that. I'm the one that writes the checks for, for uh, <laughs> Breakfast Club. So I just found out five minutes ago that apparently I'm sponsoring a ten thousand uh, dollar video challenge. <laughs> and so awesome. Glad to participate in that. Glad that I now know that I'm doing that. And so we'd love to see some, some action on that. So, uh, so, so Carl, I love the fact that you're willing to write a ten thousand dollar check. But that but uh, but uh, but that wasn't it. But I will. Uh, but I'll, I'll go into that message. So, well, first off, let me let me go back, uh, Ginger, to the first thing you were talking about. And, and actually, both of these things have spurred from the Breakfast Club. Uh, you know, as I was sitting there listening to, you know, Scott and Frank and Mike and the guys there, and obviously I, I was plugged into that when it was there was 15 of us or 20 of us, right? And now there's 120 people on there every every morning. Uh, so it's really blown up. And, um, you know, during one of the shows, something came up and I'm like, you know, hey, that's a that's a great, great idea. So literally, I, I paused my video. I opened up my iPhone and, and just recorded a quick video and just started dropping that video message out to clients or to real estate agents. And uh, and it was it was something I, I forget. I sent it to you, Ginger. I think it was super, something super simple, like, you know, hey, it's David Wakefield with Prime Lending. Just wanted to check in with you to say hello, see how you're doing. I mean, it was and that was about it. Right. And as, as a result, I got the, the CFO of, a, you know, a um, Cobble Banker uh, franchise. She and I went and had lunch two days later, nice. uh, you know, and I've met with uh, with, uh, you know, some of her top agents already just as a result of that. I uh, sent it out to real estate agents, sent it out to clients. I left it generic, uh, picked up, I think, two deals as a result of it. Wasn't asking for anything. I'm just saying, hey, here I am, you know, um, you know, hope you're well. And yes. and I do a. a pretty decent job, I think, overall in marketing and getting my name out there. And, and most people know that I'm in the mortgage industry. And therefore, as a result, they'll reach out to me, you know, uh, with questions. And, um, and, and again, something simple, no cost to it, really, you know, took right. a couple of minutes. And I just went and, you know, copy, you know, I just upload the video, post, 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 you know, and uh, dropped a little verbiage in there. And voila, 
you know, had some appointments and, and got some loans as a result of it. Yeah. Um, so I, I think that a lot of times, you know, Carl was talking about, about video. A lot of people, you know, they think that, oh, it's got to be perfect, right? And, and I, I intentionally, the video that I just posted, the $10,000 one you were just referencing there, I, I screwed up saying literacy, you know, and I'm like, you know what, whatever, you know, I corrected myself, <laughs> you know, and I was like, you know, oh, I'm going to retake that. I was like, well, oh, forget it. Why, you know, screw it. I, I don't yeah. care because it, you know, you want it to be raw. You want it to be real and you can't let, um, you can't let modesty get in the way of your marketing. Right. Okay. And I think that's a, that's a key point that a lot of people, you know, miss, right. Because, you know, they, they want to make sure the hair is just right. And, you know, I, I just want to make sure I don't have spinach in my teeth, you know, or whatever the case is, you know, and, and as long as I, as long as I'm good there, then I'm, then I'm fine. And exactly. uh, which I had spinach for lunch. And then I've been chopping down some M&Ms over here, but I think I've got chocolate and spinach uh, out. So um, we, we tell you if you did. I <laughs> appreciate that. Appreciate that. So, uh, so, so that's what it was. Right. And that's, and it was just that simple. Um, and uh, so, so that's kind of what I was doing on that. And I've done other stuff as well. I know. Um, and I'd shared with you, I think on the last uh, meeting, um, I like evergreen videos as well, right? So if I'm not able to talk to somebody, for instance, if I'm in a Zoom meeting or tied up somewhere, an email pops up and says, hey, your loan approval just came through. I quickly will text a generic, you know, hey, your file is clear to close or your loan's approved. You know, there's going to be some conditions there always are, you know, my team's going to reach out with you, you know, to you. And I've got these generic milestone videos stacked up for everything, right? Your appraisal's in it met value. The appraisal's in, it needs repairs. The appraisal's in, it didn't meet value. You know, the appraisal's in on your refinance or whatever, right. you know. So I've got all these different things for every little subject matter and it's super simple and drop a video and people are watching them and responding, love the video, feel like I know you, that kind of stuff, you know, right. so it's- Which It uh, makes that connection. So sure. I'm, I want to go into detail, but I want to sure. take a quick moment and introduce my guest. Who's okay. joining us? He's in Portland, Oregon, all the way from New York, and that's Dave Steinberg. So thanks so much. And he's here today, actually yesterday and today, and we're shooting videos. So those milestone nice. videos that you're talking about, we shot those yesterday. Today okay, great. we're shooting all the home bot videos. And okay. then we're also shooting a video for every week for the next quarter, right? That's the goal. Right. Yeah. Wow, that's great. Okay. Yeah. Well, I, I'd, I'd love to hear about the home bot videos. Go ahead, David. <laughs> this is a real amazing experience because you, you have critics live. When you goof, she, she tries so hard to be kind. She tries so hard to be kind. <laughs> I did one and she's sort of one. <laughs> so let's talk about that though, because you know we talk about perfection, imperfection, right? Mm -hmm. And so, you know, the videos that you're going to send out, the challenge that you did and you said literacy and it wasn't right. And you can, you know, blooper through that. Say, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I can't even say literacy, right? Those are good. But if you are making the milestone videos and the home bot videos and sure, they're going to sure. be used over and over and over again, then it serves you to have them to where they are. They don't have to be perfect, right? Um, but they do have to speak to everyone. And I think that's part of what we went through yesterday is making sure that message um, speaks to everyone. And we kind of went through that because yesterday we were talking about, we're doing the milestone video and um, <laughs> you were doing you were the funding video and you kept saying, good luck. <laughs> good luck, yeah. <laughs> you would close the video out saying, good luck. And I'm like, that was the grimace. <laughs> it's like, okay. You're, I mean, it's like somebody watches that and they're going to think, should uh -oh. I be concerned? And I mean, he's in New York, so it's like an attorney state. Yeah, so it's, so it's, I'm picturing, I'm, I'm getting ready to go for surgery. And I say, uh, the doc says, hey, well, here's what I'm going to do. And here's what we're going to do. Hey, Carl, good luck. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. So, so we got to chuckle about that. Um, but you know, I think, can, can, I, about that. can I jump in? Hey, yeah. Dave, I, this first time I'm meeting you. Um, would be really appreciative if you could shoot over your um, your list of touch points. Yep. Because okay. Because I have the sense that you have a really complete one, and probably forty three scenarios that I never thought of. So <laughs> maybe uh, ginger sure. this together. But I'd really take a look at it. Um, yeah, I'll I'll get something. I'll I'll be more than happy to get something to ginger. And yeah, what's funny is. 
what I would do is I'd find myself on those, uh, David, frankly, when a question would come up, I would just shoot a video. You know, I literally, I, I, and I would have one of those, uh, things you put in your, in your windshield of your car and I'd stick that on my office window and I would, and I would just you know, plop that up there and record a video and just, you know, and I don't say, Hey, this question just came up, but it's like, you know, gee, I should have done a video on that. So I'll just do one, you know? And, and again, they're, they're, you know, they're raw, they're rough, they're nothing super fancy, you know, they're generic, but, uh, but more than happy to share. I mean, I'll share whatever I've got out there. Hey Dave, I got a, I, uh, I, I got a, I got a couple questions, uh, Wakefield. I got a, I got sure. a couple questions. So on these milestone videos, um, how, how are you, uh, so we all know what the milestones are, right? And, and you ran through a couple examples. The appraisal came in, it came in good. It didn't come in good. The home inspection, you know, and the clear to close and, sure. and those kinds of things. How do you, how do you send those things out and what triggers them to send out? Like, do you, do you, do you have a particular CRM that you use or how does that work? Mm -hmm. So I'm not nearly as cool as most of the people in the Freedom, the Freedom Club that have Jungo and things like that, that automatically do it. So I'm actually texting them out, you know, or I would have, in theory, I should have someone on my team text them out following the, the who, not how uh, concept. But, uh, but as it is right now, if I see the email pop up, I, I just drop a quick text to their, you know, from my personal cell phone. Okay. Um, unless so I don't want to talk to them. that's where you store them? You keep them in a folder on your cell phone? Yeah, well, it's on BombBomb. Bomb. Sorry, I should have okay, so classified bomb bomb. that. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. So, it's uh, via BombBomb. Bomb. And, and the email I sent out this or, you know, this morning with a $10,000 check that you're going to write me, Carl, um, is... Yeah, uh, is I want to uh, keep that, track of this. It's like, <laughs> I think when, at, when we see each other in San Antonio, is that, Carl doesn't even know. Is that when that's going down, Carl? Like, who knows? <laughs> yeah. Really? He'll give me the, he'll give me the big hey, fake check. Dave, I'll find you at the bar. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. <laughs> um, so, but anyways, but that was shot in bomb bomb and then emailed out from bomb bomb right because okay. it's got the capacity inside of bomb bomb to hit you know uh send the email uh but uh but but yeah typically that's housed on my cell phone i also use text magic so if it's uh you know someone that you know i, I can have the team send those milestone videos out if i wanted to in theory i could have my loan partner you know drop those out uh and then it's still me coming in and yeah. and you know being involved in the process basically okay but uh but Ideally, in a perfect world, as you know, as you were alluding to, Jungo or, or the CRM would automatically fire those texts out uh, at the milestone, you know, and, uh, you know, and, and I would probably change up the verbiage. But, you know, but you know, you know, Dave, this, 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 go, is, this goes back, man, I love you, man. This goes back to, well, as soon as I get Jungo or top of mind or total expert or Salesforce, like insert and mortgage quest, they're all great. I've, I've used them. I think all of them. They're all great. So first I need to go get that set up and then I need to go th this set up and then I need to go get that set up and then I need to go and then I'll finally, I'll do that video. And sure, you said, no, exactly. screw that. I'm going to go ahead and do it. We're going to do it right. manually. And, right. and then I'll, then I'll improve it as I go along instead right. of making it perfect now. So great, great, great way to do it, brother. Well, and, and my, my vision on that, just real quick on that, Dave is, is it's a two minutes or less thing, right? And I learned that a long time ago. Some some of the people might remember Tim Brahim, and I'd heard him mention that way back when in Lone Pool Toolbox days. Right and on. you know, <laughs> two minutes or less. And hey, if I can knock it out, I'm going to knock it out right away. And and as you were saying, I, I'm plugged into a, a a workout group called F3. It's Fitness Fellowship and Faith. And I'll talk to guys. It's free, right? Free to all men, right? And Hey, you can come out. Oh, I'm not in good enough shape yet. I'm like, that doesn't matter. That's the whole point. Just come out. You know, uh, you know, I couldn't run to the end of the block before, you know, whatever, you know, and then I could learn, then I could run to the end of the block and then I could run two blocks. And now I can run, you know, I just did the blue Ridge relay, which was a 208 mile re relay race, you know, wow. I mean, so, so you can, you don't have to wait. It's just engage and get started. Right. As you had started with take action and don't overthink it, you know, and that's, you know, personally something that I've wrestled with is, you know, I used to be a, a ready aim, aim, aim guy, and then I would, would not take the shot, you know, um, and uh, so that's something I'm trying to get better at, and um, personally, I'm not letting myself think about it too much, just like this morning, because, because I certainly could have overanalyzed it, overthought it, I never would have done it, so I immediately said, hey, you know, I'm going to walk downstairs, walked outside, you know, by the flagpole and whatever outside, you know, and just shot the quick video um, and then hit send and off it went. So one of the things that I valued, um, I guess I've been working with you now for close to six months. I don't, I don't know. Probably longer than that. Longer than that. But 
Um, I have wanted to do videos for at least a year, year and a half. And when I saw Ginger on a, on a platform uh, doing a webinar, I guess, I reached out to her and I said, I got to do this. Mm -hmm. And um, having the coaching and also having, they just made it so easy for me to start. And now I'm addicted to it. Um, so and you're going to buy an expensive camera, right? And I'm going to buy an expensive <laughs> camera, you know, but I'm buying an expensive camera because I love toys. Let's, let's, let's keep it. Um, but, you know, but the thing is that what I, what I take away from, and I'm already a main guy as well, but what I take away from this is really, you know, if you, you just have to get off that dime mm -hmm. and and you found a way of getting it off the diamond. And for me, it was working with Ginger. And, but, but if you do that first video and then the second video, and I, I see in, in the, on the corner of your desk there, David, you have the um, Edu Marketer uh, manual right there. Um, you know, <laughs> and, and it's, it's not that, it's not which, that. Which, which unfortunately has not been filled out yet. So I'm, I'm a slacker <laughs> on that. I've, I've, I've started to do the first one, but I haven't got it done yet. Yeah. <laughs> but you already have that. I mean, you, that's the whole thing is you do it already. So, sure. you right. know, and I mean, we right. talked about that yesterday in your videos. It's like, you know, once you get the idea and can frame it up, just shoot it. Yeah. I, and, I, you know, like Carl, I, I don't know either of you guys, I'm guessing you've been in the business for a while. She, she really wanted me to use a teleprompter. <laughs> she, she was insistent that I was going to use a teleprompter. And I explained to her that all I need to do, just give me a topic, give me 60 seconds yep. to frame it. And then if the first take isn't good, we'll do it again. So, you know, the, the I'd say that whatever you're doing, um, I always believe that doing something is better than thinking about it. Right. And do what works for you, because some people love having the teleprompter. That's their, it's their would be. We talked about that to where it's like, it gives them and you read through it a couple of times, but being prepared, having an idea, you know, it's like what we have, we went through and wrote down all the HomeBot videos. So there's, um, what, probably 14 different places. So just like your milestone videos and, and Dave, you probably already have your HomeBot videos done if you use HomeBot. You know, it's funny. I, I literally, I just uh, engaged in it and then I've created all this activity and I don't know what to do with it yet. So I'm, I'm a HomeBot novice. I, I literally just plugged in and I, and one of my workout buddies was like, oh, I love the HomeBot thing you sent me. And I'm like, Oh, great. I, I better look at it. You know? <laughs> so well, so and they I just not... added the video feature. So we just came out of beta for them on the video and I love everything okay. that they've done, nice. but they have all these different points similar to your milestone um, where you can add your video. And what that does is, okay, HomeBot, I love the app. I mean, I've loved the apps when Sensei first came out with it. Um, but now with the video, now you're putting your face with that. So again, it's that connection. And as soon as they see that video, they feel like they know you. And sure, that's sure. what video does. It's like, you know, for my birthday, my birthday was a couple of weeks ago. And Dave, you were um, fantastic sending me a video and you sent it in Messenger. And, you know, those are things, first of all, watched all the videos, right? Anybody who sent a video and I got some great videos, um, but Dave took the time, sent me a video. And yours was specific to me because I know that there's a lot of people that make the very generic videos, which is great. It's better than nothing. Sure. Um, but you take the time. And that's one of the things that you do with your real estate agents, too, is you take the time to personalize that. Um, and it doesn't take long. Right. So you pick up your right. phone. Do you, and, and I have to ask, do you, which way do you record? Do you record this way? Do you record this way? Probably the wrong way. No, can't tell me you record. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> my videographer is sitting in here, and she's like, "Hey, recording." So we always ask I, for us. Yeah. we like have it horizontal. Especially. Well, yeah, and and I do record it this way typically. Uh, for so. Facebook, Facebook, if you're just doing it on Facebook, Facebook does like it where it's vertical. Okay. If you're doing anything that's going to go anyplace else, uh, like okay. YouTube, you want to make sure and do it that way. Okay, and, and I, I'm writing this down on a red pen, so that's... And I'm glad she asked you that question. So. I'm glad she asked you that question. I was sitting here sweating. I go, gosh, she's going to ask me. Out. <laughs> well, Carl, we're using your redneck teleprompter, so that... Are you sense. now? Yeah. 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 I, 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 I've always done mine this way, so um, anyway. 
Yeah. Well, and, and, and to your point, you know, so this was my, you know, when I first did the milestone videos, yeah, yeah. I, I literally, I typed it up and then yeah. I highlighted just like some of the bullet points and, you know, some of the, you know, just so it would stay and literally I typed it. I mean, I, I, you know, taped it up, you know, above the camera. So I'm looking right at it. I mean, like right. as low, as low down as I could, so I could barely see it, you know, and it took a take or two probably on those, but I, I wrote it all up and I'm like, God, there's way the hell too much. Sorry. There's way too much there. I can't, I can't, read all that. I don't want to read it anyways, because it's not right. going to sound as natural. So then I just highlighted and bolded the key points, just so it stick out to me that I, you know, that I wanted to uh, make sure they were, you know, they, they were hearing that message. And, and again, again, you want it raw, for the most part, right, uh, and personable, um, and sounding like you're talking to the individual, right. And that's, that's right. part of the whole thing in video marketing, right, it, it's that video has got to be connecting, right you know, making eye contact, you know, although I'm making eye contact with you, my camera's over here. So making eye contact with the video camera as you're talking, you mm -hmm. know, um, so that way it's going to come across a little bit better because, you know, there are three things, you know, that you're looking at. You're looking at uh, number one, creating a video, you know, uh, if you can highlight lifestyle in some of the videos, that's a secret weapon. That's why I wanted to go outside and yeah. do something. And if you're doing it, you know, Hey, I'm sitting here at bold bean coffee, my favorite coffee shop. And Hey man, I was just thinking about you, Ginger. And, you know, um, what kind of coffee do they have in Oregon? I don't know. It's kind of whatever. I mean, mm -hmm. just some kind of generic little something, just connectivity, not sure generic stuff. And then the whole, and the conversations, that's the, that's the digital currency, right? Is to get the conversation flowing. And once you get those conversations, that's when things open up and the dialogue comes out. And, and, and again, that's where I dropped those simple videos. I set the appointment with the CFO of, of Cobble Banker. You know, I've since met, you know, some of her agents and I've got a few more meetings set up with some of the top agents. And, nice. you know, I mean, it's just from just saying hello and that's all it was. Yeah. So opening up those doors, which is so important. Yeah. So to the conversation about when you're making videos, having a conversation with the individual. So when you're scripting these milestone videos out, you want to make sure you're doing that. So using you is okay. So you want to act as if you're talking to someone on the phone, right? When you say, okay, the next thing that's going to happen is you're going to receive. Yeah. You know what I do, uh, Ginger, on, on taking that? I, so if, if I've got somebody else in there re recording with me, like holding the camera kind of thing, right. uh, and in my case, normally it's a, a young lady that works over in our office, uh, Lauren. Yep. And uh, you've met Lauren. So yep. really sharply. So what I do is I'll have, I'll, I'll like, sometimes she's holding the camera and sometimes we got, you know, just a little $20 tripod that's just sitting there on the tripod, but she'll stand right beside the camera and I'll talk to her. Cause otherwise if I start talking to a camera, I don't know, I lose the realness of it, you know, so to speak. Yeah. And then when I, uh, but, but if I, if I don't look at the camera per se and look at her, you know, and, and have that conversation with her, I don't know. It just seems to have a, a different feel for me when I first started doing this. And before I had an employee to hold the camera. Um, so uh, Scott Hudspeth and I've been, you know, yeah. dear friends for a long time. This is, this is going to sound weird as heck, but I literally printed up a picture of Scott because yeah. he's my buddy. Yeah. <laughs> and I literally posted that uh, just like you had your bullet points right above the camera, David, right. I literally would have a picture of Scotty <laughs> at the camera Nice. and I'm talking to Scotty and it would just remind me I'm talking to a buddy. I'm talking to a buddy. Yeah. I'm talking to a buddy. And it gave it more of that real look instead of like, I'm trying to be an actor on TV, you know? So yeah. it's like, like anytime you're doing a, a, a video or same thing when you're writing copy on an email or anything like that. You don't want to talk like you're talking to hundreds. Mm -mm. I want to talk like I'm talking to Dave. Right. I'm talking to Ginger. Yep. And uh, so, yeah, little, little, it, any little trick you can do to yourself to say, I'm not talking to a camera. I'm talking to my buddy, Dave, or I'm talking to my wife, Maria. I'm talking to my best friend, Ginger, or, you know, like insert in every time I do a video, I think here's who I'm talking to. And I talk to that person. And I don't know. It just changes the way it comes out somehow or another. I love it. So, so my, my goal and aspiration is, is to be the guy that Carl wants to talk to. So that's my, yeah. that's my new goal, you know? So well, dude, send me, send me, a, send me an eight by 10 that I can I put think we need to do that. So I'll, I'll put it on a dartboard for you. Yeah, we'll, we'll get weird, man. Trust me. We'll get, we'll, we'll get real weird with this. So, uh, we'll make a Dave Bendy. You can just put it on top of it. One, one of the things that happened yesterday and today, yesterday, when Aaron was recording me, the um, 
she had the camera up a little bit higher and I could see her eyes, but I really couldn't see her face. And today when she re set, set, set it up again, it was just about four inches lower, but now yeah. I was looking at her face and the conversation was just so much easier because mm -hmm. I was talking to her, even though, you know, it was really the, no different other than mm -hmm. a couple of inches on the camera. But I, I, I love it. I love it that you're you have your assistant sitting next to the camera. It's a great idea. Yeah. yeah. And what an awesome person to, to be shooting video with, with Ginger. I mean, my gosh, can you can you think of a more warmer and fuzzy person like ever? You know, so it's uh, it, it just <laughs> takes they're a lot laughing of hysterically now. My team is laughing. <laughs> yeah. Hashtag fangirl over here. I'm on the fan yeah. of Ginger. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, it doesn't. And and I loved, you know, and Dave, and Dave, you've been so great because I did a webinar last year. It was kind of at the onset. And I had to look when you started. I think it's been about nine months now, Dave, Come but on. I'm not sure. But I did a webinar on how to do videos. And that's kind of how all of this started last year. And Dave has done business with me before, um, back when I created a whole compliance program back in the day when we had to do that stuff. And so he called me up. And he said, okay, I was on your webinar and uh, what are you doing? And I said, well, I'm doing, you know, this. No, is actually this. what I said, because they didn't know you were doing anything. Oh, okay. What I said was, I need this and I'll pay you anything it takes for you to get me started. <laughs> he did. And then he and said, silly I'm girl, in. I'm and then in. silly girl, she only charged me whatever, but it, you know, <laughs> she could have doubled it and I would have been in. Now the truth comes out. Yeah. <laughs> but it's, it's, it's funny you say that because I'm actually her manager and uh, that, was, <laughs> that was the deposit. That wasn't payment in full. Not a so. problem. <laughs> we'll talk offline, Carl. <laughs> Yeah, but Before. you know, it, it's a mat. I mean, you have to find what works for you, you know, and I mean, that's the whole thing. And probably the biggest takeaway for me and having our two Daves on, we're going to have to do this again. The um, Dave and Dave show. The Dave and Dave <laughs> show <laughs> is just do it, you know, and you and you said that, Dave, in, in your comment yesterday to me, it's like, I'm not Nike, you know, just do it. And, yeah. and that's really it. It doesn't necessarily have to be perfect. And it doesn't have to have, you don't have to have the CRM in place. You don't have to have all those pieces in place. You have to have a, a way to record it and your sound being there, right? And you have to have a way to deliver it, which bomb, bomb, easy way to do that. You can just text it, you know, it's like, you want to keep it on your phone and then text it to someone. I have not used text magic. I'm going to, you know, I have a different texting platform I use, but um, you know, whatever. The main thing is, is to get started and to do it. Hey, I got. Uh, I know. I know we're uh, we're up on the top of the hour here. Yep. Uh, just one run one, one more uh, quick question for me, Dave. When you shoot your videos, uh, are you are you using literally a, a smartphone? Yeah, yeah, just my iPhone. Mm -hmm. And are, are you do you use an external microphone or do you just like uh, just a built-in generally? Microphone? Generally not. I mean, um, I mean, like when I was down uh, this morning shooting the one um, I plugged in my earbuds or whatever, just, I mean, but that was, that was it. So, so, but no, no, no external mic, nothing like that. And, and the one, uh, when I was going to meet the CFO of Cobalt Banker the other day, literally before I went, I pulled up a quick, uh, you know, six steps for buying a house in today's market or something like that. I wanted to see what came up. I read the six steps. I hit record and I recorded a video as I was driving you know, uh, which I don't recommend, by the way, yeah, you know, but, uh, <laughs> you know, don't, don't, you know, don't, don't give me a ticket, you know, but yeah, I said, hey, you know, <laughs> yeah, here, you know, here are six steps to buy a, mar uh, buy a home in today's market, you know, first off, ding, 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 ding. And the last one, the sixth step was work with a real estate agent that you know, I can trust kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, so literally on my iPhone, again, mounted to my windshield in that case. Um, and, uh, and that went out, got a bunch of likes, dropped it on a few pages and groups and things like that, you know, so mm -hmm. Uh, but not, nothing fancy. Now, you know, I will say, I'm sorry, go ahead. So, so, dude, I did not know. I did not know that if we have our little AirPods in, that that acts as the mic in the, uh, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the video. <laughs> and, and, and I don't know if it does either, you know, either or not, technically. I'm not a, I'm not a tech guy, but it, but yeah. yeah, but. But you have yeah. to make sure. So you have to make sure, first of all, that it's just you doing the video. So if it's someone else doing the video with you, right, right. Then it's mm -hmm. not. The other thing that I, I would recommend um, is when you're going in to meet with someone and you met with the CFO at Coldwell Banker, 
And it is being bold to do this, but just say, hey, you know, I shoot a lot of video. You know, do you mind if, you know, we record a video here? Bring your tripod. You can bring your external mic. Rode has a nice little mic. How much is the Rode mic, Aaron? Like 55 bucks. The like external, 79. 79. Mm-hmm. So 80 bucks. Do the external mic, bring a tripod, set it up, and just say, hey, you know, I post a lot on my social media. Do you mind if we, you know, what are things you're seeing in the market today? Because what is that going to do? That's going to connect you with them, right? And we find that videos are shared more often than any other medium. So whether you do, you know, an article, whether you're doing a graphic, videos are shared. And so that's the next step as far as doing that. And you're already great on the fly. So get a little road. I'll drop it into the um box here as far as what it is and you can just throw an external mic on there get your phone make sure you you know do it horizontal and just say hey you know dave you know what i do a lot of video can we sit down and just do a quick little two-minute video talk about what's happening in the market right right you know what you know what ginger we've been together for almost 24 hours yeah you know two four we haven't shot a video together and i haven't shot a video (laughs) endorsing you Ah. <laughs> so that will be our next video <laughs> All right, very good very All good right. okay so like for it. the two days i want you to both leave us with three things that you recommend somebody do to get started in doing video in their business today and wakefield i'll let you go first I was going to say whatever, whatever the other Dave says. Um, <laughs> so, well, I mean, obviously, you know, again, don't let uh, modesty uh, get in the way of your marketing, right? So number one, right? Uh, just pick up the video, shoot the video. It's fine if you do a take or two, you don't need to be, you know, perfection is not necessary. You know, just get the message across. And again, people want you to be, to be you. Um, uh, apparently uh, shoot it, uh, you know, shoot it this way, right? Uh, you know, I suppose. So that's, that's a big thing because um, I've, I've not been good at that. And, um, and, and just, you know, post it out and tag people in it, right? Because you got to make sure that, you know, if, if there's something that you want to get the message across and if you're going, man, I, I bet if I tag Carl because I know he likes, you know, whatever, fa- you know, fancy cars. And I always see that and I was, I was by this Lamborghini or whatever, and I'm going to tag him. And now maybe it's going to get some more people in his sphere, you know, t- you know, chiming in. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I, and that's just very, very rough. But I mean, basically just pick it up, shoot the video, get the message across, whether it be, you know, texting directly or using a, you know, a platform like BombBomb or Facebook or Instagram. So just, uh, just do it. I mean, I'm, I'm trying to do at least one video a day right now, and I've been not been good with it, but I'm trying to really re-engage with that and uh, start getting videos out, uh, even if it's just simply a birthday video to somebody. Yeah, so. perfect. Okay. And Dave. So... I think the first thing is, um, I, I love the fact that Dave is sitting there in an office with the book in the background, his, his whiteboard behind them, the, the door with uh, whatever. I mean, think about how real he is. And, and, and Carl, your space is so polished. <laughs> no, he knew serious. where you were. No, He's but, on a green screen. <laughs> yeah. But, huh? Are you on a green screen? No, no, he's because he, his head is moving and his and and this, the background isn't. Yeah. Oh, you are. That's your thing. Okay. Yeah. So, but but, think, but what I love about both of these guys is that they're so real, and um, so my journey was really three steps. Number one, um, after looking at Bomb Bomb for years, just getting on Bomb Bomb. And the reason I say that is because Bomb Bomb will make it incredibly easy for you to record. Mm-hmm. And um, what I do half the time is I record on Bomb Bomb, I download it, I upload it to uh, Ginger and Aaron, and it's done. So, I, advice number one is um, is 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 Bomb Bomb. If you're recording, uh, if you're recording from your office, for about three hundred dollars, you can have an amazing setup. Mm-hmm. And I'll make one comment. I, I'm not trying to criticize you, Dave, but if you spend thirty dollars on a light, oh sure, right. your video would and, be and, a million percent better. So, and, and, I'm, so, and I'm in a temp space right now, by the way, and I'm videoing uh, this, by the way, and I'm I just because I want to make sure I get your message to me. Perfect. 
<laughs> but 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 you know but so a, a real when I when I committed to this um and it might have been in early in the year when I committed to this the first thing I did is I went out and I bought an iPhone 12 and I said if I'm going to do it I want to have the most up to date piece of equipment for it then I bought for about $300 I just bought some equipment for my desk doesn't take much and now you're set the third thing is, I'm going, to, I'm going to repeat what Dave said, because it's just so true. Do it, do it, do it, mm -hmm. right? It, it, the first time, I know uh, Aaron, uh, the video editor, says, here, look at it. Tell me if you like, tell mm -hmm. if you like it. I refuse. <laughs> I say, I, I just can't look at myself on a video. I just, <laughs> I, I, I feel, you know, I'm an old guy. And, you know, I know every flaw that I have. But, but whatever it is, just get past it mm -hmm. and record one. Send, send one to your honey, send one to your uh, best friend, send one to you your can't. assistant, and then do one, do another. And if you can get into a rhythm, um, and, and for me, an investment of two days away from the office was just crazy. It's just an insane thing to do, yeah. but we've recorded a whole mess of videos. And so whatever it takes to do it, just do it. And the good thing about it, those videos will work for you going on and on. And I had people reach out to me that literally watch a video that literally I did 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. I honestly don't even remember recording it. And I was sober. Don't, I wasn't in a blackout or anything. <laughs> I don't, I just don't remember doing it. And I had people, you know, reaching out from, you know, videos done, you know, years and years and years ago. And yeah. uh, so it's like that little sales working force. Like it's these little elves working in the middle of the night for you on your behalf on ongoing. So the work you do today just works for you again and again and again and again and again and again. It's awesome. So great, great topic, Ginger. Awesome. Well, great guests. So thank you so much. And, um, you know, we'll drop everything as far as what we put in the comments. We are recording this. I've had a couple people that have asked share us with your friends. So I've put us onto a URL, it's mortgagevideomastermind.com. And that links to the webinar. If you register for the webinar, you will get a reminder every single week. My friend, Carl White led me onto that, said, this is what we need to do. That way people get a reminder. So we're doing that. We stream live on Facebook. We are posting it onto YouTube as well. We have a YouTube channel, we're posting it. And so, uh, so we just want to make sure and help everybody do video. So guys, thanks so much. We are not doing a call next week. I am on my way to Wisconsin. So we're not going to be doing a call next week, um, but we will be doing a call the following week and we'll have information on that. So thanks guys, go shoot a video. Thanks guys. <laughs> Dave, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you.